of buying a single cigarette at a time. Are you ready for a change? Hi, I'm Francis P. Jenkins. Not only am I the creator of the Francis P. Jenkins Guide to Credit Repair, I'm also a client. Even a lazy, chronic masturbator like you can get good credit to purchase things like beepers, VCRs, or TV antennas. Well, I'll tell you a secret. Not too long ago, I was a lot like you. Sleeping on till 4 p.m., waking up, enjoying a good Girls Gone Wild commercial or two, and heading right back to bed. My life was changed forever one day while shopping at the convenience store. I met a very special person who put me onto a path where I could one day have a beeper, where one day I could have a VCR, and a path where I could purchase an antenna for my TV, all because of good credit. Now, who was this person? This person was a white girl. Did you know that it's a scientific fact that white girls have astronomically good credit? And did you know that instead of asking people on their credit card applications if they're white girls, lenders employ dogs that can identify the scent of lilac candles and cat hair, once the dog smelled this very specific, very scientific combination, that application is immediately approved. So, step one in applying for a credit card, once you've scoured the scent of Doritos and failure from yourself, just rub a lilac candle and a stray cat on your application. Don't worry, both items will come in handy in future steps of my program. Now, the question I'm most asked by my beginning students is this. With this program, do I absolutely have to buy clothing for her dogs? The answer is, with a resounding, hell yes you do. <laughs> Stay calm, viewers. I can show you how to turn this most demeaning and ridiculous task into an opportunity to better yourself. Maybe you were headed out to pick up a Spider-Man costume for your toy poodle and while you were out, you might pick up a few CDs and a watch. Sadly, your toy poodle ate your wallet. Now as crazy as that sounds, if you tell that story to a white girl, she will hand you her credit card and you will promise to pay her back. I'm here to tell you this, you will never pay her back. One of the biggest hurdles my students face is how to get that first white girl to turn over the keys to the kingdom. The first step is always the hardest. But with my tried and true methods, you'll have her paying for your independent album release in no time. Here are just a few of the myriads of options you'll have. Create a childhood tragedy that you're still struggling to overcome. Purchase a Big Brothers or a Big Sisters t-shirt. Pretend you've recently overcome a terminal illness. Even fake a European accent. All of these steps are critical in not only in creating excuses to borrow her credit cards or having her pay for things, but for some reason that science can't answer, these things set off triggers inside of a white girl's vagina that...